good morning and welcome back everybody to another prepared 3d video this morning we're going to be doing a full flight uh, out of philadelphia don't believe i've ever flown in philadelphia on the channel before uh, flown into or out of philadelphia on the channel before uh, we just arrived from miami this morning and then we're going to do a quick turn now to boston so i've decided to just Record the whole flight, why not? Uh, we've got a New York uh, ARTCC uh, VATSIM event going on right now. Uh, Top-down services uh, throughout the entire uh, New York AR ARTCC uh, airspace. Uh, so they're covering Philly, they're co covering Newark, uh, LaGuardia. And all of the little minor Echo. airports in between. Direct Henzi, Papa Echo. Uh, and with Sierra, that comes Yankee, some additional services as well GA from the surrounding direct ARTC. So we had uh, Washington Saint Center Saint online with us when we uh, made our way up from Miami. And we also had, uh, or we have uh, Boston as we make our way up. So we should have uh, top down services. Going all, all the way up to uh, to well, Boston this afternoon. Really so we've got the aircraft loaded up. Uh, we're going to jump in now, get our final numbers, uh, program our performance numbers as well, and then get our departure clearance. So without further ado, let's get going. company message so this is our load sheet so we're looking at 135.0 looks like we have a revision here and we've got a Mac zero fuel weight of 33.0 Okay, United 5-9, got that. We're clear to our field. The route is Philadelphia 2, radar vector step mic. Looks good there. Uh, X-ray echo. We'll go ahead and accept that. That's J-48. And I'll print that as well. Uh, we'll hold off on our performance numbers for now. Let me just get our clearance information from uh, Philadelphia. Star. We need our ATIS. Let's pull the departure ATIS up. So information United Delta. 180 uh, at 4, 10 statues a mile. Uh, uh, QF5500 uh, is carrying 20. 2980. Got that programmed in. And we're looking at a departure runway of 27 left. Advise ready to taxi. Okay, 3005 Squawk, uh, departure window. Looks good there. 4, 5,000 initial climb, and we'll call you for taxi. 9595, thank you. Philadelphia Ground, good afternoon, American 2336, uh, information Delta, IFR clearance to Boston. Logan, it's filed, please. American 2236 Philadelphia ground clearance on request standby one second standing by all right while he's uh getting our clearance let's I don't think our departure runway is going to change so let me get our request American 2236 in. oh he's ready cleared to the Boston Logan Airport Philadelphia 2 departure Radar vector is ditched, then is filed, maintain 5,000, expect flight level 23010 minutes after departure, squawk 3015, departure is 128.4, Philadelphia approach, and squawk 3015. America 2336, cleared to Boston, Logan, Philadelphia 2, departure, radar vectors to ditch, then is filed, climb and maintain 5,000, uh, departure 138.4, 3015 in the box. Three thirty-six to read back. Correct. Advise ready to taxi. 
We'll rise ready taxi, thank you. Alright, so we've got departure clearance as uh, expected. No change to what we filed, so let's go ahead and put our numbers in. Two seven left. Uh, packs will be off, yes. Uh, what are our wins currently? 170 at 4. Two nine or eight oh we always want to take one less, so we'll go two nine or seven nine. And temperature we're looking at twenty seven degrees Celsius, we'll go twenty six degrees Celsius. Uh Toga no config one plus F should uh, be enough to get us off of two seven left there. Pretty long runway. Estimated takeoff weight we said was one forty eight point six. And our MAC takeoff weight is 31.8. We'll go ahead and send that. Queued and sent. Uh, while we're waiting on that to come back, let's start the APU. We'll get the fuel pumps on. And we will program our secondary flight plan and departure radial fixes so we'll copy the active just in case we need to return to philadelphia for an engine out or any other uh, type of emergency and we'll come back into we'll plan two seven right no via that's good radial fix info so we're out of 27 left. And engine out procedure will fly the 268 radial to a uh, radius of 25 nautical miles. Uh, no noise abatement procedures required at this time of the day. So we're good on that regard. We've got our performance numbers now. That looks good. Uh, down 0 0.7. We said the MAC tile was 31.8. Let's just make sure that lines up here. No, that would be more... down 0 0.3 so we'll go one down I guess FS Labs is still working on getting that sorted out uh, because those numbers are are not correct flex temp 69 and we got 150 52 and 53 Looks good. Looks good. We get the APU bleed on now. Don't need the external power. That's uh, Squawk Mode Charlie. Make sure the cockpit door is closed and locked. Windows closed and locked. Let's see, anything else I'm forgetting? 1600 Zulu is our pushback time, so we are right on time. No smoking. Let's get the beacon signs on. No, it's right. Let's get rid of the external equipment.
skating down the uh, apron there. Flight attendants, prepare doors for departure and cross check. Stand by for all calls. Ignition start. Fire up number two. So the Philadelphia 2 departure, as you heard uh, in the readback, is a vector departure. Um, so what you do out of uh, the runways here is uh, tower will give us an initial altitude for the climb out and then uh, we'll go over to departure for vectors to ditch and then onward northbound into uh, the New York airspace or we'll get New York Center and then we'll uh, be handed on over to Boston so pretty short 45 minute flight for us this afternoon Brakes are set. Number two is alive. Number one now. Your tray table is stone. If you have a carry-on, push it all the way under the seat in front of you. If it won't fit, place it in the overhead bin. If you have a handheld device, please switch it to airplane mode now. Two nine seven nine nine or wind one four zero seven. Two nine seven Alright, flaps one. This aircraft is designed with escape lighting on or near the floor. Assignment. Oh, ignition mode normal. Flight controls, we said. One down, 0 0.3. It's full left. Don't need the APU anymore. Help locating them. See your safety card. Remove the vest from the package like this. And ground uh, American 2336 information Foxtrot ready to taxi. 
Okay, American 23, 36. Looks like we're switching over to the nine. Stand by one second. All right. Of course we are. Now we got to rerun numbers. Gotta love it. Can I even still do a performance request now? Yeah, I guess you can. All right. Let's, let's see what happens here. American 2336, runway 9 left at Whiskey, taxi via Romeo Kilo. 9 left at Whiskey, Romeo Kilo. Well, we're going to need a few minutes to redo our numbers here, American 2336. All right. Uh, Philadelphia, we said nine left. One three zero at seven. I could understand that switch with the current winds. Oh, that's fine. Q and H two nine seven nine. Temperature 28 degrees Celsius. Toga no config 1 plus F. Estimated takeoff weight. Was 148.6. send that off and then let's uh, reprogram the box so out of nine left Philadelphia 2 that doesn't change our departure procedure it'll still be uh, yes I know we ran a performance it'll still be uh, vectors a vector departure So let's wait for our performance numbers to come back. Hopefully it still works. I've never had to do that with uh, with this aircraft after pushing back and doing it the first time. Uh, let's update Navigraph. And change this to 9 left. So again, it's still a, a vector departure. All right, uh, looks like the performance numbers came back. Flex on a 67 now. Still one down, 0 0.3, and then we got uh, 49, 49 and 50 for the V speeds. American 2336, uh, Foxtrot, rated taxi, 9 left, whiskey, uh, can you repeat the instructions again, please? Uh, American 1529, runway 9 left at whiskey, taxi via Tango, Kilo. Is that for 2336?
Uh, affirmative. Romy and I left uh, Tango Kilo, Whiskey, American 2836. Hey guys, it's Tammy. We're all set back here. Cabin secure. Thank you. Thank you, Tammy. Clear to left and right there. Get this taxi light on. Takeoff config is normal. American 2336, MTAC Tower, 118.5, good day. 18.5, good day. Tower, good afternoon. Uh, American 2336, taxiing to runway 9 left at Whiskey. Okay, 2236, uh, flight heading 115, what's your assignment rolling? Heading over for takeoff. Right now, left clear Alright, that's a straight out departure for us. Let's get the rest of our lights on here. Uh, don't need the packs. Trying the cabin one last time. T-A-R-A -A on the transponder. Start the clock. Stabilized. Thrust set, man flex, SRS runway, auto thrust is blue, and airspeed's alive. It's 80 knots. Positive rate of climb, gear up. 115 on the heading. Departure, good day. Love your departure. Good afternoon, American 2336. Out of 1 1.5 for 5,000, 115 on a heading. 
Let's climb thrust. Packs uh, can start coming on now. Twenty three thirty six, hold up here. Departure, radar contact, climbing, chain, one, two, twelve thousand, direct ditch, one, eight, hold. One, two, twelve thousand, direct ditch, American, twenty three, thirty six. All right, cleared up to twelve thousand, twelve thousand blue. And we are now direct ditch. Alright, we are going to take this down to establish and clear the left approach for any line of the first place. Get the flaps in now. Spoilers disarmed. And we can get the first set of lights off. Turn offs can go and the nose lights can go. Twenty-five thirty-two. Have a great weekend. Yeah. One more twenty-five. Just before I think of it. Center, good day. I'm the Express two thirty-seven. Yardley, flight level three seven zero. New York Center, good afternoon, America 2336 out of 6,000 for 12,000, direct ditch out of Philadelphia. America 2336, New York Center, good afternoon, finding people 230. 230, America 2336. That is a true New Yorker there. That New York accent is heavy. Nothing like uh, flying with uh, air traffic controllers that are from the region that they control. It's pretty cool. Makes it more immersive and, and fun. Alright, uh, Autopilot 1 can go on now. Center, hello, United 1992 with you, one seven thousand. Alright, that's ten thousand. Lights coming off. Don't smoke inside auto. One thing, two eight three, United 10, uh, we're just, uh, I see Roger Sunlight. Well, I should attend to your center good afternoon. You're supposed to be with me. The center maintains part of the 270. Roger that. Uh, the center maintains 270. 
Just to show you here what we're working with. Uh, again, plenty of air traffic control on. So I don't see Boston approach on here at the moment. So our next frequency will probably be uh, Boston Center. That's fine, but uh, plenty of uh, New York controllers on at the moment as well. New York, can I get out from left 3, just 6, 5, 3, 5, 0. Left at 3, 0, 6, New York, approach, go correction, the center of this one. Cross Wacky at 1, 3, Donaldson, Washington, or New York, uh, I'll fill it at 2, 9, 7, 9. 2, 9, 7, 9, cross Wacky at 1, 1, 3, that's the most of your share 6, 5. So, like I said, it's a uh, pretty short flight on up to Boston. After the Kennedy VOR or Kennedy Airport, uh, we start our approach via the Roebuck 3 arrival. Let's see what that looks like. So we want to make sure we cross per the chart here. Seventeen, sixteen. At Roebuck, we want to be at two sixty between nineteen and twelve. Probably at eleven or above eleven. Uh, Sophie at two hundred twenty knots between ten and nine. Ernie between eight and seven, and then uh, Muzo at two hundred ten knots, six thousand. programmed here into the box. So effects two three zero. Louise two one Alwyn Alwyn seventeen Banky above 6, Roebuck 260 between 19 and 12. We express 237, contact Boston, 1134.7. So it's... 347, get out of here, Omni express 237. Make that 260. Russia 10, Boston, 1134.7. Roger, Boston, 1134.7, Russia 10, thank you for your ACC sign. Above 11, Jody, Sophie, Ernie, Sophie 220 between 10 and 9, okay, that yeah, looks good. American 444 to 718 for level 190. American 444 to 190. Make our altimeter standard here through 18,000. United 1992 cross lurch at 14,000 altimeter. Now we've got a company message, probably uh, the gate to expect upon arrival. And yes, it is. We're parking at Charlie 23. 
Confirm to point print that and we'll get the arrival Alert. ATIS as well. Information Alpha is current at Boston. Roger, cross Urchin on one per thousand. So yeah, it is Print both of those out. American 444, sign checking approach, 128.12. So let's get our... American 444 to New York approach. Coordinates numbers in for the landing here. Actually, I think uh, Alpha's out of date. Uh, active sky is showing me 14 degrees Celsius and 070 at uh, 11. United 1923, climb 18, follow 230. Cool. 230, United 1923. So we have Alpha for now. Um, it's probably about to update here in a couple of minutes, so we'll grab the updated ATIS uh, once we get closer to the airport. And I don't know that American parks at the sea gates at Boston. I'm pretty sure that's JetBlue. So we're going to park Bravo 9 this afternoon. probably have enough uh, time to stop and vacate at Foxtrot. If not, I'm sure 3 3 left is available for uh, for turn off. It's usually noted in the ATIS when you're coming into Boston. Parting runway nine, so yeah, three three should be available for turn off. And then Bravo nine is um, or is it one here on this Boston scenery? So.
Park Bravo 8. Although that's a really long taxi. Yeah, sir, uh, at 11,000, still heading as your father. That's fine, we'll park Bravo 8. Step Blue 318, your center is good afternoon. Proceed direct to Merrick, on the main chain 17,000. I'm saying 17,000, direct to Merrick, just like right Air center, hello, good afternoon, American Industry 77, five miles west of State Run, level 850. Yeah, Lodger, I'm calling to take all time. American 8377. American 8377, your center, good afternoon. And I'm crossed in Crosscade, out of maintain flight level 190. This is 8190, I'm at 8277. And United 1992, uh, just to confirm uh, your crossing the words, out of maintain 14,000, right? Now, if we're going to cross the church at 14,000 to the United 1992. JetBlue 318, contact Boston Center, 134.7 today. Boston 134.7, JetBlue 318. United 1923, clock to maintain flight level 240. To flight level 240, United 1923. United 1923, contact Washington Center, 133.72 today. United 1923, was it 3372 for 1923? Uh, United 1923, uh, 133.72. All right, can I, uh, United 1923, over to 3372. Center, good Let's see what the traffic looks like in this uh, airspace. New York, good afternoon. Deep on 4901, descending uh, flight level 29 or correction, flight level 280 for flight level 250. So that's us. I don't know, it's the JetBlue. So we're trailing the JetBlue. Looks like JetBlue's going into Boston as well. So he's going to hand us off to Boston pretty soon here. Level 190, P1409-01. United 1992, contact Approach, We've got that Southwest going into Boston as well. And we had a bunch of people arriving from... Uh, Europe and parts east. Looks like we still got a few. It was a really nice event today. It was nice that they utilized uh, many different airports as opposed to just one or two. I'm sorry, repeat that. Uh, United 302, are you on frequency? I am on frequency. United 302, cross Sierra, at me to flight level 200. Well, Boston Center's calling me, but he oh, didn't hand us off, so. Let's see what's going on. He must have forgot about me. New York Center, um, Amer never American 2336, we're getting it's pink. Okay. Uh, stand by real quick, and Zebra 3427, proceed direct to Robinsville, on the maintain flight level 200. Direct Robinsville, New York Center, American 2336, do you want us over to Boston Center? And let's see, what was that call sign? 
American 2336, we got a, uh, a call me from Boston Center. American 2336, contact Boston Center, 1347, good day. 347, good day. Um, ILS 33, I'm near Express 237. Western 1113, contact New York approach on 128.55, good day. New York on 255, Western 1113, I'm still there. Boston Center, good afternoon, American 2336, uh, with you, flight level 2304 from FEX. American 2336, Boston Center, good afternoon. Descend via the Roebuck 3 arrival, runway 4 right, except do not exceed 250 knots. The Boston Alpha 2986. Send via the Roebuck 3. Four right transition, except do not mean uh, do not exceed two five zero knots and copy the altimeter. American twenty three thirty six. JetBlue three eighteen clear direct Pro V maintain three zero zero knots or greater. It's Pro V and three hundred knots or greater. Definitely slow us down here to two Air five Canada, seven zero. fourteen to center maintain eight thousand. Down to eight thousand, Castle. Air Canada 714, contact New York Approach on 120.8, good day. New York Approach 120.8, Air Canada 714, thank you, good day. Austin, I'm going to go to 920, ready to And um, let's see, I have already given that to you, sir. Uh, um, Anatolia 920 cross trade at bottom level 2 4. I want to thank you. Uh, we will now start on the journey to 4240. KLM 66 Charlie, maintain the best speed. Let's try to slow down. And KLM 66 Charlie, clear direct Calverton. Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. Direct Calverton, Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. KLM 6 Charlie. Boston Center, United 237, reach you at uh, 9,000 climbing for 14,000. Uh, last aircraft check, uh, United 27, Boston Center, climbing maintain flight level 220. Alright, that's the flight level 220 for United 27. Still gaining on that jet blue there. Make our speed to 30. Good afternoon, I'm Calum 64 MC Fast of 302 miles in Mount Upper Quality Kingdom. Good KLM 64 Yankee Boston Center Squawk American 2336, turn right, right turn heading uh, 110, and you can expect uh, Roebuck in just a moment. Right, 110, we'll expect Roebuck in uh, just a moment, American 2336. So that's vectors for the spacing there between me and that jet. Double 318, descend via Roebuck 3 arrival, runway 4 right, Boston altimeter <coughs> 2986. 
Thirteen thousand blue. Back to two fifty now. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's get the seatbelt signs on. Sky is showing one zero zero at fourteen. United two thirty seven, clear right Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. Two nine eight six, still good. Two nine eight six, clear right Charlie, Charlie. We got overcast down all the way to two hundred feet. Uh, visibility is point three statutes of a mile, so. It'll probably be a Cat 3 landing here. Alright. Altimeters. 2, 9, or 8, 6.
November 435 Hotel Papa, contact Boston Approach on 133.0. 1330 KLM 66 Charlie, contact New York approach on 125.2. One, two, five, point seven, KLM, six, six, Charlie. November six, zero, five, Alpha, cross Calverton, Charlie, 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 at one thousand. Speed 250 knots, Kennedy altimeter 2981. Charlie, 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 1212000, 250 knots, 605. And we're in the soup now. That's real wild. Now we're at 920, contact New York approach on 125.7, good day. Yeah, it's only at 920. Contact New York approach on 125.7. 125.7, I don't know. Team contact Boston approach on 133.0. Boston Center, Delta 1973, with you, passing through 6500 for 1400. Delta 1973, Boston Center, maintain 5 level 220. Make sure to follow the CTU. KLM 645, descend and maintain 5 level 240. Continue that descent down now to uh, 11,000. United 869 Boston Center, squawk 4702. Squawk 4702, United 869. Delta 8940, we're at 330. Delta 8940, Boston Center. Good afternoon. Stand by for a transponder code. Delta 8940, squawk 4664, 4664. 4664. American 2336, contact Boston approach on 33.0. 330, take care. Have a good weekend. Boston Approach, good afternoon, American 2336, uh, sending via the Roebuck 344 right, out of 11.4 now, information echo. The ILS runway 4 right approach, Echo, she joined the ILS 4 right localizer, American 
All right, passing through 10,000, no smoking signs back on, and the landing lights can go on, as well as the logo lights. Uh, I realize we forgot to clear out the secondary flight plan, so we'll copy the active now, and we've got to clear out the radio fix from Philadelphia, so we're good there. Let's keep that descent going down now to 6,000. at actually let's resume the uh, speed there Blue 318 is full right Blue 318 three miles four miles from when you press on the air about 4,000 for the right first that's when we had about 4,000 speed off right full right Blue comes that uh, those thick clouds that's probably right over the airport Windy at or above 4,000, clear Alice for right approach, American 2336. Windy is after Goshi. Boss approach, Delta 1539, descending on the ocean upon arrival, and we have Delta. Alright, altimeter 296. Alright, we'll so we've got right. uh, uh, Winnie programmed in and he wants us to cross Winnie at or about 4000 and then we're looking for 4 right here. So the frames are probably going to go to crap now. Uh, we are in the FS Labs, of course, and uh, the Boston scenery, even on a clear day, uh, is a bit challenging. Flaps 1. It is 18, wind 12014, runway 4 right, wind. 4 right, close to land, just lose 18. Flaps two now.
going to help us get back on the uh, path here. All right, it's 4,000. Uh, Activate approach, and there goes our glide slope and localizer. Thank you, Tammy. Twenty-five hundred. All right, we'll take the second autopilot here. Cat three dual. Got about eight miles to the runway. That's checked. Alright, uh, flaps three, gear down. Four right clear, land Americans, my 336. It's our auto marker, height check, misapproach altitude is set. Four mile final, flaps full now. Left, heading one, let's take a one three zero. One three zero, at the top. Still nothing. If we don't see it before our minimums, we'll have to go around here. Uh, Boston Center, can that uh, Jepu that just landed say what altitude he broke out of? So that's good. Alright, landing checklist really quick, gear down, three greens, auto brake low, flaps full, spoilers are armed, all lights is required. Land green, checked. 300. Okay, 
I still can't see anything, so technically we should have went around, but... Retard. 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 How to not land an aircraft. Alright, it's manual braking. I'll make this exit here. We should have definitely went around, but whatever. Alright, 49 minutes. Turn left, uh, 33 right, cross runway 4 left, and then left November, American 2336. Jet 18 Boston, the first cross runway 3 to 11 November, taxi to Alpha. Go 3 left, and uh, second to the total by Alpha. Go 3 Pleasure aircraft, Boston, British, Fox, right now, current, Boston, altimeter 2986, and the runway 4 right, RVR. Is uh, six thousand touchdown, four thousand midpoint, five thousand five hundred roll up. And five hotel pop up, the wind one two zero at one four, and way four right, clear line. Clear line, five miles. Delta fifteen thirty nine, just going to maintain three thousand. Down to three thousand, Delta fifteen thirty nine. Clear left, clear right. And uh, Boston Center, American twenty two thirty six, we really didn't break out till. Um, 200 feet there we technically should have went around but it was uh it was pretty low back at 2236 roger all right left turn on to november we can get the strobes off now and the turnoffs. American 2336, cross runway 33 left on November, then taxi via Bravo, echo to the ramp. Cross 33 left uh, at November, then uh, taxi via Bravo, echo to the ramp. American 2336. And we said we were parking Bravo 8. Delta 3, cutting Delta 1539, trying to think 310. Right 310 is up to 1539. Let's pop on the mid. 35 Hotel Papa, firing 040, come and maintain 3000. I want to have a fantastic. I don't know what's going on at Boston today. 040. I can barely see the aircraft in front of you. Did he say Alpha or Bravo? I think he said Bravo Echo, so we'll stay on. Yeah, I think he said Bravo Echo.
and approach past the passage. Would you be able to get the uh, visibility and the healing that you have to work? Yeah, that jet pool said he so broke it at 350. The airport's reporting 200, which is roughly what we broke out of. Control M954 ready for the clutch at Norwood. Control M954, stand by. Control M1539, two miles from uh, NABO, class NABO at 3000, corral us from my four right approach. We're delaying the uh, APU start uh, here, we got a wrong taxi. A deer cut, I try to know it's in. Control M954, ready for the contact. Control M954, departure from the ramp at your own risk, report airborne. Apply to my risk, my risk and report airborne, Control M954. Cover 1539, the wind 090 at 14, from way 4 right. Please land, touch down RVR 6000, midpoint 3000, roll out greater than 6000, and the preceding aircraft is serious when around. Part of that, we'll give it a shot, Delta 1539. Clear to land. Fairfax Hotel Pop Up, turn right 170, and I have weather for you from Nantucket and also Providence, which is currently staffed. Oh, there's that Delta so we'll coming in. Today. I'm curious to see if he's going to go around or, or land. Uh, we can go ahead and take a look. Uh, Alright, well, sorry, it's good everywhere. And then, Here's Echo, we'll make a right turn here. Clear. Temperature 16, dew point 13, altimeter 2984. And Providence is wind 16012, visibility 10, two clouds at 5000, two clouds at 11000, temperature 21, dew point 15, altimeter 2983. Roger, uh, you really cannot see a damn thing. This is incredible. I will get the APU fired up now. Terrible. Control 954 for Roger. Radar contact and uh, signal to that. Signal to that. Signal to that. Signal to that. Uh, see you Providence, 3500. Okay, Sean, thanks, Sam. Close to destination airport. Uh, Providence. Roger. Flap open, start the APU. At Delta land yet? Oh, he's five miles out. Approach. It's possible it's like to uh, remain in the area for uh, vectors um, until to get a possible high rep from the next landing aircraft. Hi, Boston. Air Five Hotel Papa Roger, turning two two zero, and uh, Delta Boeing seven thirty seven on a mile and a half final, so I'll have to wait momentarily. Is this guy trying to VFR in this weather? My gate. American 852 Boston approach, good afternoon, altimeter 285, flighting 060, back to the ILS runway 4 right approach, oh. going to maintain 1 Off to my right back. here. And a 737 is pushing back. Let's get out of his way. Alright, we'll kill these lights so we're not blinding anyone. Bravo 8, 
Oh shoot, we passed it. Alright, let's swing around here. He's gonna run right into Delta 12, Delta 1267, runway 9 taxi via Alpha, Kilo, Mike, cross runway 4 left. Did he land that Delta? Wow. Runway 9 uh, via Alpha, Kilo, Mike, uh, cross runway 4 left. Delta 1267. Delta 1539, by runway heading, climb and maintain 3000. Climb and uh, fire runner heading, climb and maintain 3000, Delta 1539. Delta 512 Papa, the preceding Boeing 737 that just went around, I'll get you one Yeah, so he around. went around. I'm the only idiot that, <laughs> that landed with that visibility. <laughs> oh man, you gotta love it. That's why it's flight sim, right? We've been flying all morning. To be honest, if it was the first flight of the day or something, I would have went around and we probably would have needed to divert to Kennedy or something, but I am. Done for the day. American 832, fighting 05. I did not feel like going around, so here we are. Alright, uh, break set. AP is available. Kill 2, no, kill 1. Delta 1539, when able, just want to verify, uh, were you flying a Cat 2 or 3 approach on the list there? That was Cat 3 for sure. No, uh, that was a uh, Cat 2. Oh, Cat 2, okay. Delta 1539, Roger. And when able, say your intention. Uh, we can give Providence a shot if you want to shoot us over there. Delta 1539, Roger. Could it be Providence Airport via flight heading 170? Expect radar vectors. Common maintain 67. Alright, clear to the Providence Airport via uh, heading 170 and we'll expect uh, radar vectors. That would have been cool and to divert, we'll I think. I've never yeah. diverted in this, uh, on this aircraft, at least. Anyway, we're down, folks. Thanks for watching, and uh, we will see you next time. Take care.